Hi everyone, in this video I'll be installing PyHole on Windows 11. In order to get this running, I'll be installing WSL, Windows Subsystem for Linux, then Docker Desktop, and then pulling the PyHole image. I'm going to open up Command Prompt, and install WSL. Yes. And this will install Ubuntu by default. Okay, it's completed, and I'm going to restart my PC now. All right, it's asking to create a default user account, so I'm just going to use the same account name for Windows, and we'll put in a password. And the installation is successful. Now I'm going to download Docker Desktop. Download for Windows. OK, it's done downloading. I'm going to open it up. And I'm going to install. Installation succeeded. You must restart Windows to complete installation. So I'm going to restart now. Okay, and it's asking for the acceptance for the Docker subscription service agreement. So I'm going to hit accept. And I'll continue without signing in. And what's my role? And I'll just pick other. And I'll just do local development. And I'll continue. And it's going to start the Docker engine. This might take a little bit of time. Now I'm in, I'm going to look for pie hole, and I'm going to pull it. OK, it's downloaded. Now I'm going to go and run it. Optional settings, so I'm going to use the default, 53, 53, 67, and 80. And the host path, I'm going to put it under my documents pie hole folder here. Select the folder and hit run. OK, and now it's running. And scroll up here, we'll get the password, assigning the random password. So here's the password. Copy it. Open up Firefox, and I'm going to open up Command Prompt just to confirm my IP. I'm going to copy the password, log in, and now we're in. We're in PyHole. So there you have it, and that's how you install PyHole on Windows 11. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye now.